Hey there, Gamer Obscura here, coming to you with Sonic 3 and Knuckles. That's right, Sonic 3 and Knuckles, like the lock-on technology. Of course, I'm just playing with the EverDrive, so... I don't have anything locked onto anything. And we're gonna try and get all the emeralds, like all of them. Not just supersonic, but hypersonic. Which I didn't even know existed until just a few years ago. Believe it or not, I've been playing this game for... about 30 years now. I, th I wanna say this game came out in 94? So right around there, I mean, I never owned a copy of this game. I only ever played it through rentals and whatnot. So I'm not nearly as familiar with it as I am with Sonic 1 or 2. But we'll just see how it works. I mean, the Blue Sphere bonus stage, after playing Sonic Mania a whole bunch after that came out, you know, I feel like I'm not that far out of practice with these. And I mean, I love the Blue Spheres. This is my favorite Sonic bonus stage by far. You know, it's way better than the half pipe. It doesn't make me sick like Sonic 1's does. Although, I mean, when this thing starts really moving, you know, the longer you're in it, the faster it goes. And it gets really frantic. Especially if your controller's not cooperating like mine doesn't seem to be. I don't know, man. I don't know if there's some lag on this. It's just the Genesis version of the 8-bit Doe controller. I didn't seem to have any problems with Sonic 1 or 2, though, so I don't know if I can blame it on that. Well, we'll just see how it goes. You play these long enough, you start to realize that there is kind of an intended path you're meant to take, like just a logical order of things. But it's easier said than done navigating through it. Because I'm telling you, this thing really speeds up. You start to panic and, you know, trying to turn at the right time, it's not easy. But we'll get ample opportunities for this and we just nailed a perfect. There we go, first emerald in the bag. I think there's two rings in each act. Except for in the launch base zone, so that should give us ten... Ten tries to get, what, seven emeralds? So we'll see how it goes. We'll just see how it goes, I keep saying that. Is there a way to speed this up? Your reward for being perfect is a very long... Exit from this screen. We did get to continue though, so that's nice. I don't know if I want to get perfects anymore, that took forever. I mean, you know, points, ooh. With more points, you get, you know, more extra lives and whatnot. We'll see, let's see how far I can do this Deathless. I made it to what? The boss of Hilltop Zone, I think? In my Sonic 2 playthrough, which by now feels like an eternity ago. It's crazy to think that much time has already passed. Like, you know, one of the, um, basically one of the first series I did. Now, no, I missed an extra life. I remember that now. Shit, can I get back down there? I bet I can. I want that extra life. Extra life! So let's see the platform. Come back down, platform. Can I even get up there? No. Shit. Damn it. Wait, here we go. Dude. Okay, is it even worth it anymore at this point? Oh, wait, we got it. We're good, we're good. I mean, I do want extra lives. There we go. Get to hear the new extra life theme. That was new for Sonic... Sonic 3. And Sonic and & Knuckles. I mean, they were always meant to be one game. I don't remember why they weren't. At first... Like, you just see a whole army of these things in the background. I don't know if I've ever noticed that before. But this is so cool! Oh, another bonus stage. Yeah, there's two different kinds of bonus stages now. You get the giant ring. Oh, I already messed that up, sorry. Alright. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention to what kind of bonus stage it was. Hold on, there's another big ring down here, I think. Wow, that's a bummer. The good news is, when you go into one of those checkpoint bonus stages, you don't lose all your rings automatically. But here we go, another blue sphere. So as you'll notice, if you're not familiar with it, when you find big clumps of the blue ones, you just want to grab the ones on the outside of the rectangle or square or shape, whatever shape it happens to be, and then all the interior blue ones that are, that remain will become coins. You know, so just go outside, and instead of having to just make them all red, because when you touch a blue one it turns red, and then if you touch a red one you get kicked out. But if you just go around the perimeter of a blue shape, it just turns into a bunch of coins. And if you get all the coins, you get a perfect score. I'm just gonna try and get continues and stuff. And then I'm not really worried about perfects, because it just takes way too damn long to scroll through all that stuff. So now I gotta continue, let's just get on with it. 
Because like I said, the longer you're in these, the faster it goes. And it just gets way crazy. I think it does max out your speed eventually. Like, it, it won't just go infinitely fast. But it's, it's enough that you want to get moving and not be hanging around too long. Because trying to make these turns, it can get tricky. But I think these are the last ones. So there we go. Two emeralds. Two emeralds already. Heck yes. We are doing great. We are doing great. This is exciting. I love this game. I love the music. Does it have better music than Sonic 2? I think so. I don't know. Hydrocity. Hydro City. <laughs> I mean, everyone knows that theme. And then, of course, in Sonic and Knuckles, you get the flying battery. And those are like the two biggest bangers. And of course, everyone loves Ice Cap. Launch Base has a pretty cool theme. I think Marble Garden is the only one that like I really don't like. And even then, like I can't say I don't like it. It's kind of like with Mega Man 2. It's like there isn't a bad one. There's just a least favorite. Oh, I missed a lightning shield. I kind of want that. Can I get up there? Tails. Tails, grab me. Does he not do that in this game? I thought Tails could grab you and help you up places. Maybe not. Oh, well. Shit. Dude! Are we at the boss already? But this theme right here. Like the steel drum sounding bit. I think that's what they were going for. So good, man. One of the most memorable themes for me. Like the first time I played this game. I was just blown away. And you can bounce the signpost around. If you hit it like right when it touches the ground, an item box sometimes pops out. And it's usually either just 10 rings or some kind of shield or something. Yeah, let's see, up to Act 2. I'm not sure how I'm gonna break these episodes up. I mean, back when I was recording Sonic 1 and Sonic 2, episodes were much shorter just by design. I don't know if I'm gonna follow that pattern now. So we'll just see, I might just make it naturally one, one zone per episode. I don't even care about continues anymore, to be honest. Let's just try and get all the emeralds. The sooner I can get six emeralds, the better I'll feel. So let's just not worry about grabbing these coins. I don't care about getting perfects. Let's just see what we can get. As you can see, it starts off this nice little chill pace here, and it just picked up in speed. And if I was going for all these coins, it would have done that a long time ago. Not time-wise, but just where I would have been in the stage. Like, I wouldn't be this far along had I been going for all the coins. So it's just one of those things you gotta keep in mind. Like, is getting all the coins really worth it? You know, that's for you to decide when you're playing. I just, I don't really care. I don't anticipate running out of lives. So let's just, let's just do what we can here. There's plenty of opportunities for continues in other ways. I think, or is it only in these? I don't even know. I don't even know, but we're three for three on emeralds already, so I'm feeling pretty good. It's more my concern. I mean, you become supersonic. You really don't have to worry about dying anymore. So, whatever. Let's just get on with it. Uh, one of the cool things about this game is the stages tend to be much longer, like Carnival Night, which is my favorite zone in this game. If I had to pick one, I love that zone. It's just batshit crazy. But it's long. Like, seven, eight minutes per act long. Like, even if you're not looking for stuff, it's just, that's how, it's just that long. And that's okay. Cause it, dude, it's not like you're in a hurry. I mean, maybe you are. But, you know, like, you still only have shit. You still only have a 10 minute time limit. Wait, okay, never mind. we're over here. Because there's, there's still another ring to get. I just gotta try and remember where it is. Ah, dude. And this is nice. 25 rings will get you the checkpoint bonus game. And it changes. We Now we get the, the Carnival Night slot machine. Let's see what we can get. Actually, if I can get 50 rings in here, I'll get a continue. So let's just see. Shit. As you can see, it's kind of like a, a hybrid here of Sonic 1's bonus stage and the Carnival Night. Let's just get out of here. We gotta continue. We have plenty of rings. Like, I don't care about getting an extra life or anything. 
But yeah, the longer you hang out on these, eventually they'll just turn to goals and then it kicks you out. Or you can just hit one of the goal blocks that already exists. Dude, you son of a gun. Oh shit. Where am I now? Actually, wait. This is okay. Oh, I just didn't didn't have the speed. You gotta have speed to do some of this stuff sometimes. What? That was pathetic. Come on, man. You can't be going that slow. This is Sonic. This is Sonic, man. Ugh. Yep, you still get the spin dash, of course. Dude! You can do, like, this weird slash when you jump. I don't know if that really helps. Sometimes. Ooh. The other bonus, I think, is down here. You stupid electric worm. You're worse than the eels in Awesome Possum. Can I get a ring? No, I cannot get a ring. Shit. I have no rings. Oh, man. He jumps very unpredictably. Out of the water? Oh, my gosh. That was scary. That was actually terrifying. I'm not going to lie. Actually, I think the bonus is just down here. Jeez, I was right there. What the hell, man? Like, have I ever played this game before? Sure doesn't seem like it. It has been a long time, though. I think it's been almost four years since the last time I played this game. I remember streaming it once. I was just doing a, just a co-stream with my buddy Yosh. We weren't even playing the same games. We were just playing different stuff, and we were just both streaming and... Just kind of hanging out. Oh, gosh. Ooh, that is tricky. Yeah, but that's what'll happen. You'll get these bonus stages. Like, just when you think you've got them figured out, they throw you a curveball here and make you do tricky jumps like that. But if I can get all four emeralds here, you know, that are available in Angel Island, I'll be really happy. Oh, gosh. So, yeah, so this. This is, a, like, a, it's not a square. It's like a plus shape. But yeah, if you just grab all these exterior ones, they all go away. Oh, that was all I needed. Holy shit. All right. Well done. So if you want the continue from there and the perfect and whatnot, you have to take that bit out first. But there we go. Four emeralds. Just like that. And there's, what, seven? There's seven, right? I don't know. We'll just go with there's probably seven. Ugh. No, it disappeared, you bastard. You bastard. Don't do it again. Oh, God. You gotta be fast, man. And again, of course, it's Sonic. All right, wait for this one. There it goes. At least it makes a noise when it shows up, so... You have some kind of audio cue, at least. Hey! That's a nice little secret there. Those things are jerks. You still got the monkeys throwing coconuts at you, of course. All right, another bonus. What is this one gonna be? Is this gonna be the... Oh, it's this one again. Okay, so you, you ride these, it's kind of like... Oh shit, all right, I really suck at that one. I'm trying to think what that reminds me of. But I'm not sure, that might be the first time we were introduced to that kind of a thing. Holy crap, where am I? Oh man, I don't have a flame shield, but yeah, here we're getting to the end. And this is so cool, like, you just have to keep running. And this big plane comes, I guess it's the flying battery. It starts dropping bombs on you. And like, in the background, it's just, everything's on fire. It's crazy. And the music... I just, I love this, this Zones theme. I love them all. They're all good. They're all great. This bit here. You can get a couple free hits on him before he burns the bridge. And then let's see. You just don't want to end up... Ooh! I guess if you stay in the middle, maybe? We'll be fine here. Get some free hits on him. Oh, shit! One more. Ugh! I mean, I'm not concerned about taking damage. There we go. He's done anyways. Hey, another bridge fell down. How do you make Tails grab you? I thought you just, like, double jumped. Whatever. Let's just do that. What? Tails? What? Tails just ran off 
Into the... Into the abyss there. What the hell? Why did he do that? There he is. Uh-oh. Yeah, Knuckles is always fucking with you here. And there the bridge pops out. And there we go. We're in Hydrocity. Hydro City. I'm gonna pause it here because we're gonna save that for next time. Hope to see you there. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.